Hi, I'm Amelia and I'm here with Clinique to answer some questions. In the most curious place where you have ever had to get ready, a sheep's trailer, up a mountain, train, loo, carriages, quite a lot of those, in a car in the centre of London, a moving speedboat, that was interesting, try and do your hair in that kind of wind. What is your desert island beauty product? Mascara, 100%. That's all you need. Loads of it. Despite there probably being no mirrors. And someone else might be stranded there. Brad Pitt. What is the best life advice you've ever been given? Don't ever Google yourself. Ever. No good has come from Googling yourself. What is the one thing about the US that you do not understand? Oh, yes, this. When you've finished your food and someone else hasn't, someone will take that plate away immediately. I think that's so rude. I also don't get this whole exclusive relationship versus a non-exclusive relationship. But we're not exclusive. I don't, I, again, I don't understand. Speaking from experience, no. <laughs> what do people who impersonate a British accent sound like to an actual Brit? There are a few American actors, actresses especially, who can do a perfect British accent. Gwyneth Paltrow is one of them. Shout out to Gwynny. But it, it's really rare. Tips and tricks for in-flight skincare. Hydrate. Take off your makeup, do all your steps. 11, 15, 12, 2, whatever it is. Those spritzes, lip balm, moisturizing lotion, eye mask, sharp elbow in case you're next to someone who's snoring. What is the proper way to prepare tea? It's instinctual. I just make a great cup of tea. I can sense of people what kind of tea they want as well. It's like a special party trick. Really fun party trick. Plane or train? Trains are just more romantic. Planes have become something that I have to do so much for my work and it's so bad for the environment. Greta, I'm sorry. I spent my childhood getting on the train to London and I loved it. You can just watch out the window, you can put in your music, read your book, people watch. It's beautiful. What's a beauty trend that you've done and regret? When I was like 11 or 12, the coloured mascaras. What? I it doesn't work. Why do people think the British are so apologetic? We've got a lot to be sorry for. <laughs> Historically, it's a form of passive aggression. Oh no, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean for you to step on my foot. Just awkward little bit. Am I coming across like that? Sorry. Blonde or brunette? In my heart, I am a brunette, but getting to try on being a blonde for a bit is an enormous amount of fun. And you know, mother of dragons ain't bad. That's pretty much it.